Okay. It's gonna get a red, yeah. Q50's got the regen in base. Oh, great. Uh, Alright, so wasted power ups in terms of attack, so. But I don't think Hot Hot, hot need to. They got four minutes to go. They, you know, they want to secure that home power up and a regen, and then they can just chill out in their base, and that's gonna kill. Four minutes is a lot of time to survive out. It is, but it's. I think it's um, a little enough uh, that they can, you know, really think about. They need to focus on the mid power up and then getting it back to their base rather than the other way around. I think. I'm not sure if a constant aggression is going to be on their mind. It's always a risk, the mid power up when it's haste, because if you go down and you drop a haste in your base, mm. you're almost inviting. Well, either quad actually yeah, as well. Regardless of whichever it is. Yeah, it's an invitation, isn't it, for them to absolutely dominate you and then get a cap back. So you've got to be cautious in that area. Mm. If you have a stacked player, I think it's maybe more useful to move them to your enemy space. So even if they then kill you, they haven't got any time to use it. Yeah. Trafertex is going to attack there, but Q50 is out positioning him. Surprising him quite a lot there, I think. And yeah, Q50 is absolutely stacked now. And uh, power-ups up in 10 seconds. Well, we could be going to a third here at this rate. Maybe Three third. minutes left. Go Let's see it. what happens on this penultimate power up. Yep, it is up now. Let's see if anyone's going to take it. Hazard's got it. Doesn't take a rail and manages to get past. Well, these are the big grabs these last few minutes. Is Hazard going to be allowed to take it, or is Q50 going to get it? He just wants yeah, to make sure they get the regen. It doesn't disappear or whatever. Okay, so yeah, Q50 has it now. I was watching, I know, but there's also a flag touch as well. Phoenix has got it though, he's gone to mid. This is a great sort of uh, mm. a, a moment to distract Unknown when they're on this uh, power up run. And yeah, this is this is good for them, but. There was another flag touch, but. Oh my god! That's unbelievable! Q50 does just get that flag. Gerber dropped it for wins, but wins ignored it and dropped off through the gap. Oh my god, yes, flag versus flag! Phoenix got Q50. through. Oh, I don't know why Q50 dropped off there, but it's probably going to work out alright. He's got 14 health, just avoids that rail. Sparty's going to take it instead. They're weak now though, this Wins is hurting him. Oh, and there's a rail from behind! Q50 could get the cap Oh my god! Oh, there's another rail! Oh! It's gonna be <laughs> oh my oh god! Shit. You could hear that come in, I'm surprised Q50 didn't try and dodge. That was absolutely mental. I, I thought, okay, he hit the rail, but you know, he, he could afford to take one, but... He also hits the the you know, be a cat. another no. one. Oh my god! I, c I can't focus on the game right now. That moment there was just too ridiculous. Absolutely clutch, clutch play. Was it? Was it? Who got the rails on a Q50 there? Was it Vertex? That was, it was really you know, impressive stuff, and that it could have possibly won them the map there. Wins yeah. That was, uh, Excellent. Yeah, I think they can the same Last the chance is going to be this power up coming up in 10 seconds. I'm, <laughs> I'm really honestly surprised that Q50 didn't just dummy a jump to the flag. Yeah, let the rail yeah. shot go. He was just, he was rushed. Here we go, flag pick though. So Q50, look. that rail shot could mean a lot. Was Don't know what happened to the to power him. up. Oh, he's going oh, down! He's returned! 45 seconds, I still. And Hazard had the haste right in front of him. Oh, he's gonna wait on this regen in the blue base, so it was good timing from Hazard there. Took a bit of damage there, Mackie gets him. Good shot. Very nice shot from Mackie, very important. Now it's just defensive time. I'm gonna watch Q50 though, he's got a regen. Yeah. Don't well, kill Q50's Phoenix. been the main man on this map before. I think so, yeah. In attack though, I mean. Oh. He's a defender, oh my god, on his own. That's the problem with that attack. Look, and then Hazard on his own. Or oh, wins, was it, sorry? Um, yeah. I think they should have just controlled their excitement a little bit there. A little, yeah. I mean, and attacked as one, well. but... Wow. All that goes down to that, that save, yeah, on the oh, flag, and we're going to a third map. That save was incredible. Who got that, uh... The cap there. I don't know, as soon as he got it, he didn't care about the enemy flag. He just get the return, get it quickly. I think he got it and also died very, very shortly afterwards. Like, within a second or something. So, so intense. But that was some of the most uh, clutch play I've seen in a long time. Impressive stuff. And it looks like we are going to go to a tiebreaker map. Which is nice to see. We haven't s didn't see this last week. 
I'm gonna... I'm gonna tiebreaker. Japan... I think this castle's tiebreaker. Right, let me just do a commercial. Right. I'm going... Oh, it's uh, Shining Forces. I just quickly spammed out uh, that... I wonder what other people, are, what Specs were saying about that. That was, <laughs> yeah. There's quite quite some uh, attention from it in uh, the Twitch chat. It, that was sick. I mean, if anyone, you're you're allowed to sort of edit vods and make highlights. If anyone wishes to do that, um, make a little uh, clip there for that holy shit moment because that was insane. Just that sort of 30 second period or so. Somebody can tell me the demo. Oh, I don't know. But VODs are going to be up as soon as we uh, go offline, so... Regeneration. I was... Uh, <laughs> inside. I don't want to be too critical in Q50. You think um, you should have dodged it? it e yeah. It's easier said after the event, though. I mean, yeah, I, pro I, I would have done what you did. Let's be honest. Dive for the flag. Yeah, and tough. because... Because the problem is, if you do the dodge and... He hits, then you look like an idiot. If you do the dodge, he misses, and then you dodge so wide that you need time to jump again, and then he hits the shot. You're gonna look stupid. Exactly. It, it would have the very fine line between you know being ridiculous and getting the cap. But what I probably I, I think just about feel... doing is just stopping dead still, and I think he would have missed the rail because he would have been leading. But it was, was it was is still a great rail shot. It was pressured rail shot. He had to hit it. Did I kind of took out Q50? Uh, I kind of felt like it was coming out as soon as I saw the first rail, and then I realised there's enough time for another. I was like, oh my god, this it, it's going to happen. <laughs> I, I thought he ran out of time, but it's like he slowed him down a little bit. Oh, I'm just not smart. But this this map here, um, Q50 was uh, upset at me last uh, week because I, I I didn't big up big up uh, wins enough and. Defense here. Apparently, wins is awesome in defense, which he is. We saw him last week. In the easiest map to defend. Um, I don't know if it's the easiest, but if yeah, he's stunning it. No, I don't. I don't. I never play defense, so I I couldn't get my own personal thoughts on that. But Demon looks like he's replacing Sparty. I guess. Uh, I think that's a. I think that's a publicly normal switch. Demon much more experienced on this map. But I do favour unknown here on um on shining forces quite considerably. You favour unknown, okay. Yeah. I think um I don't know, I think it's like a fifty fifty map. Yeah. Yeah, I think you get very lucky on spawns on this map. And I've seen some really coordinated play from Hot 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 on this map in the past, so I, I think it's really 50-50. Maki and Demon playing together is always fun. We got Phoenix. Phoenix will be defending. I th still think, even though Wins is arguably the best defender on this map uh, at the moment, I think Phoenix also does a really spectacular job himself. I, I always am um, very kind about his play. I think it's more about the attack as this map anyway, because as I, I yeah. think it's an easy map to defend compared to other maps. Um, so it's more about what the attackers can do if they're well coordinated. Uh, the both of them moving in together is so important as a map. You need your coordinated attackers because one attacker moving in on his own is going to get demolished on this map. It's such an open area. You've got to dive for a flag in such an open zone. You're going to take range damage first moving in. The escape paths aren't great without team support. It's a really team attack map actually. Definitely. Even though most people don't like it. <laughs> well, I, I'm really looking forward to what uh, Maki has to offer here and what Kerpa has to offer. I think uh, they're going to be you know, the attacker for each team that are the ones to watch. Uh, and I think Vertex, if he just grabs a railgun on the back of the base and attacks the rail, I think he could do a lot of damage that way because he is a, a bit of a rail hawk. So definitely, yeah, I think something they should consider. And probably something they've considered. We are waiting for Vertex and Lucky 2 ready up. Alright, I'll be back in two seconds. No worries. Just as we count down to the tiebreaker map of the Grand Finals in CSN's Playquake Live European CTF Points Cup number 2.
These teams are playing for extra points to help secure their way to um, the, uh, fi the the finals event, which is happening in probably about a month-ish, roughly. I don't have one last week. I think I got 24 points or so for that. Something like that. Roughly. Uh, it looks like the Zotac finals was a complete washout, by the way, for anyone who's curious about that. The Avic won 3 0, so, you know. Bothered. So, basically, I mean, in conclusion, uh, watching CTF is the better thing to do. <laughs> I think what Vid is saying is. Uh, Powered by Solar Gaming Lead, thanks again to them for uh, hosting these tournaments, putting money forward towards it. Uh, Great Club community is ever so grateful for what they've done, and hopefully we're going to see more in the future. So do go visit that site, it is solargamingleague.com, plenty of fun information there, check them out. I don't know if they have a Twitter or anything, check them out, Solar Gaming League, I don't know uh, what their at tag is. And not to forget, follow Level Up TV on Twitter. That's at Level Up TV. Also follow me at Zoot Live or Disrepute at Disrepute. And uh, we'll give you fun information about Quake and everything that's going on. Also like us on Facebook. It's all it's all Level Up TV. So slash Level Up TV, IRC Level Up TV. I'm gonna stop saying Level Up TV. It's like to grind me. But uh, yeah. And. Uh, if you want to see more clutch moments like you saw in the last map, do keep watching the CTF. It is on next weekend as well, and I will be casting it. And it will be on the weekend after that, and dates will be announced on ES Reality about the finals. And it looks like we are going live, so here it is. Map number three. Unknown versus Hot Hot Hot. I'm on a Gerper at the moment, off the beginning. He's going to get the first rocket. It does make it to mid first, but... They've gone through the high uh, entrance, and that means they don't get any red armor fun. So red armor probably did actually go to a uh, hot, hot, hot player. Triple H player. Cool. And Gerber kind of wandering through a little bit. Is he going to get an early touch? No, he goes straight into the attack on Phoenix. Lovely aggressive mood, and Hazard, wow, so fantastic team play there. And I like that Gerpa didn't just go to the flag, he went to uh, the defender. And I don't think Phoenix is expecting that. Phoenix in trouble. Hazard uh, coming through, missing the jumps and Q50 there. Suffering, he actually loses out on it. But Vertex as well is going to go down. So they do manage to get the flags back on the, on the uh, pedestals. And uh, things do go back to... to their normal ways in the first minute, and here it is, Phoenix there, and let's go on to Demon, just, I just had to power up for a while. They need a regen or haste there, Gerpa with one touch, and I don't know what happened to Demon, Demon possibly went down there, as there's been no flag touch recently, Phoenix gets the return with one HP, and already from the beginning, kind of seeing Unknown, being a little bit more confident with their attack. And getting a flag out just a bit further now. 50 with a touch. Probably going to drop down low. There's a yellow armor, but he doesn't manage to get it. And then Phoenix trying to do damage. Q50 missing the follow-up rail. And Phoenix back into position. Going to switch around. I want to see... Uh, wow, well, that was Maki there. I think he was suffering a bit. And Hazard going for a little attack. No health up like anywhere, and there's a rail from behind, Maki on it immediately. This rail actually is a bit low, not doing... You know, hopefully Maki's going to get a bit into this. You usually see some great things from him. And I will be expecting to see some excellent uh, flag running or support work from him. Phoenix up, stacked up again, so he's in good shape at the moment. If you can avoid taking too much damage from Hazard now, it should be alright. Yeah, that's not too bad. And not to forget, we haven't paid any attention really to the red armor that's in the middle of the bottom here. And one player did take it, I think it was a Triple H player. Maki getting the kill there. And Regen haste up in just a second. Which one's it gonna be? Hazard playing nicely. Demon keeping a bit of a stack going. I think it was him actually. He stole the last red. And uh, Phoenix calling the timeout. I'm just gonna have a quick sip of water. Ah, sorry about that, if you can hear me, 
Ludwig. Ah, there's a Vertex there who has uh, timed out. This could be an extended uh, timeout break. Prepare to fight. Three, two, one, fight. Uh, and they want to pause. <laughs> so are they going to come? Well, I'm sure he is going to come back over. I mean, if not, then I guess Sparty's going to sub for Vertex, which might mess with things a little bit. But Q50 Prepare says he'll be back. Fight. Three, two, and one, let's get the pause on. <laughs> and they're still playing. This is... Get them to pause it, come on. And uh, Disrepute's abandoned me. I'm quite upset by this, actually. It's left me on my own. It's, uh yeah, there's someone. Prepare to fight. Uh, hey, wait. Three, two, one, fight. Yeah. Um, mm hmm. Yeah, interesting comment that this is saying. Actually, Sparta's been playing Quake for over a decade. Q50 maybe since Quake Live, he says. But maybe a Q50 having more experience in the recent CTF. That's yeah. just a possibility. No, Q50's been playing since the start of Quake 3. Oh, really? Okay. Three, two, I, I remain one, corrected again. Five. He's been playing for the UK for a long time. He was. He was better than Deuce, put it back then, back in Quake 3, originally, when they first started, he was above Deuce's level. Oh, I'd, really? I'd say he's probably behind him now, but... Yeah. But uh, Q50... He played for four kings. Ah, okay, okay. Well, Q Q50, though, to me, seems the type of person who's very fussy on what map there is. <coughs> because, what do you mean? Uh, I've seen in some tournaments or cups, Three, he won't two, play, he'd rather one, someone else sub for fight. him, because there's some maps he just refuses to play. Yeah, I guess when you've played that that long, though, you're not gonna you know the maps you don't enjoy, and there's no point playing them. Yeah, which I guess you could look at it from a couple of different ways. But uh, what? <laughs> They're staring at Demon. He's still got the power up now. Yeah, this is a bit of a <clears throat> strange amount of time to set a timeout for. Prepare when you boot the fight. server, you get to choose how long the yeah. timeout's set for, and 30 seconds? It it's not really long enough to sort out anything that would require a timeout. And then the server booter isn't on to actually no. pause it. Haste. Exactly. I think they've run Haste. out of timeouts as well. Yeah, so... Haste. I I don't know what happens now. No, it's not I they, could, they could just restart. Vertex has gone off the line. So Vertex is the host. Yeah. And presumably his connection got... Sorry, Sparty could come on the server though if he wanted. Oh no, he can't because he's on the studio. studio. That's what he says. Yeah, it's not very long oh, Vertex game. Is on. <laughs> Are they going to continue though? Um, he sh if he could just come in and pause it. Or maybe they'll just go straight into it. I would just play on, to be honest. Yeah. I think, I think all the players really sort of abandoned their responsibilities for a, a brief moments. It's 200, 200. They aborted the game. Fair enough. Yeah. They saw that wins was 200, 200, so they're like, no, we won't do that. Alright, so now it's already. Um, okay. Yeah, so now we can monitor, we can, we can be the, uh, the justice team. I, I took the right time to disappear, didn't I, really? Yeah. Because I didn't miss anything, it's in effect. Pretty, yeah. Massive fluke. <laughs> <coughs> Are we all just waiting for Hazard to F3? Should I do a little intro? Go on then. Welcome to Level Up TV at levelupbegame.net with me, Disrepute, and Zoot. Hello, there. there you go. 
Awesome. Unknown versus Hot 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 in the what is this tournament, Zoo? This the CSM uh, European CTF points play Quake Live points qualified number two. I messed that up. Number two, yeah. yeah. But the number two one. And this is the grand final of that series. Let's have a look at the teams quickly. Q50, Gerpa, Wins and Hazard for Unknown and for Hot Hot Hot. Vertex, Phoenix, Mackie and Demon. This is the third map, Shining Forces. Winner takes all. Yeah, and uh, Gerpa, I won again. We just watched him the last time around the map. Started for, wow, was that? Demon got the first red. So quick to get there. And this time Gerpa actually did go on the, the low uh, entrance. This could be quite good actually for Hot Hot Hot. You've got two players moving in, of course. Demon with that armor. Wow, very aggressive. But then. <clears throat> I didn't really take into consideration they were coming up against wins, did I? No, he's just hit 57% LD. But I guess it was a good angle for him to be hitting that from. Yeah, a lot of that's bounce pad on the second kill, but. Here we go, first power up of the map. Where is it? So is that regen? Demon gets the first Q50s on it. Maki not able to stay alive long enough to uh, hold his ground. It looks like Q50 is just going to go straight with it. Should, oh no, he's deliberating. He's like, should I... Get the shards, mate. Would I? Could I? Doesn't want the shards either. Just let it build up, actually. That's an intelligent play. He's going to get caught out by the rocket attacks, though, by Maki. Yeah, I think he's just run out of LG ammo now. Now he needs that rocket. She's not I don't know why Maki switched to rail, really. So he's actually got it. Wow. I don't know how this has worked out. It's, it's filled really, felt really Wanted soft. that LG. Has it just stole it from him? Uh, he's defending uh, for him a little bit, so maybe not too bad that it took, but it has stopped Q50 being able to get out of the base we go. so quick. And Phoenix with a great rail shot there, and all four of them bunched up together. That is going to be a return, but they need to quickly get back up. Oh, this yellow is going to be stolen by Gerpa. That's a big steal because, of course, the defense relies on that yellow mm. and the green out the front. Yeah. So this map, it's got a, a central power-up, a bit different to the first map which had no power-ups and the second map which had three. It's now just got one power-up. And very few items, and not no mega health or anything like that. Mac no, is yeah. a touch, he just saw the yellow armour behind him. And Tried to get back for it, blocked by his teammate and Q50 <laughs> takes full That was advantage. just a, a fail. Pretty much, Q50 going back there. Is he defending a bit? I'm trying to work. It, it should be wins on the I think he's just covering for wins there. He's, he's high defense or something like that. High attack, mid defense. I think I just named every position there. In <laughs> Coach. <laughs> yeah. Vertex there with the red. Keeping a bit of it. It's still got something. Oh, that's alright. And yeah, this is what I was thinking attacking the rails. And I think that, is, that would work out for him quite nicely. He must find himself a railgun on the floor, actually, and that's really nice for him. Almost hitting another one on Hazard. Hot, hot, triple H uh, are going to want to keep the... There you go, second power up of the map. Oh, In the hands of Hazard, just get railed. Could be key. And Vertex with the flag pick. I like this. this is yeah, nice. he's tricked him completely. That's really nice. He's double trick him. Oh, he's oh, waiting up. Oh, he's not. <laughs> they can't fall for that. I think Vertex yeah. is being too, trying to be too clever there for his own good. With the health he had, I mean, it was kind of something he needed to do. Yeah. He didn't expect Gerp to be there, I guess. Wow. Hazard. Hazard just now with the out. haste moving out. This own. could be a cap. It looks like it's enough as well. Yeah, there it's you go. Enough. Oh my god, is he in behind? No, it's not going to be enough. And uh, no take the need. 12 seconds, it's not bad. So notice that uh, Reds are slightly closer than they were since the restart. I mean, in the first the first game we started, it was 5-1 on Reds to um, Hot Hot Hot. Now it's just 5-3. So they're still getting the advantage on the Reds at mid, though. Obviously, got to focus on that. Yeah, there's always there's always focus fire and stuff like that. So I mean, they, they might have the they might have the stats of it, but they're probably doing in favour of unknown, quite possibly. I doubt they would get away with many. Uh, Undamaged reds. Demon there did go down trying to attack out. Wind's only hitting 35% the rail. Yes, not too good at all, is it? No. It does finally get the back to back shots on Vertex. Second impressive. Hey, on second sort of power attack. The yellow was just stolen. Hazard with the flag grab. Oh my god. Steals that green armor as well. He's got teammates supporting him. Nice shotgun work from oh. Demon. And finished a lovely sweet spawn. Yeah. That's what you have for. Oh, no, well, not if you hazard. 
Yeah, quite. Ten seconds to go until this mid power up, so I guess both teams will start thinking about that. Although Demon's got the flag grab. Oh, Gerpa there. Oh my god. Beasted it, but they might miss out on the power up as a result now. That's true. Oh, Hazel's got it. Too bad. No red for some time. Should probably think about backing up. Yeah, that. He's plasmering his teammate there a little yeah, bit. Yeah, he was. He was really shooting at him, wasn't he? <laughs> What is he doing? No idea. He's, he's, I, that he's red, worried about he's losing, I think. Yeah. But now he's just giving it away. So Vertex and Demon are coming in now. Suddenly change of hands, and I don't know why they don't doesn't focus on getting these grabs and stuff. He's just run. He's just gonna run with one second left on it. Here we he's go. He's got teammate minute. supports in love. Oh, the rail oh. from behind. Have they managed to wins. Is it gonna again? be enough though? Look at the pickup. He had to jump to get that demon. <laughs> Oh, Hazard's taken him out, and Phoenix now on the flag. He's stacked. This is surely it's gotta be a cat. It's gotta be. Where are they coming from? That is gonna be a one-one. Yeah, equalizer. Nice play there. And that was good. Was it Mackie who was making it out of base there? Uh, with the haste, or was it? It was Black Mackie or Vertex. I can't remember. And just getting it far enough out into mid so that his teammates could see him pick it up from him. And both the flags there went down. Demon actually wanted to get another touch sooner. But that was return. Triple H's flag is still... question mark? Ah, there it is. Ah, uh, Hazard wanting that yellow, but not gonna get it. Phoenix taking him out. Gerpa's gonna go down as well. That's exactly what you need to do, what Phoenix did. Just rush and make sure you deal yeah. with the flag carrier as quick as you can. You can't just sort of... Oh, he's gone around the corner. I'll just stay here and sit at the choke point and try and catch him out because he'll just trick you. He'll just mm. stack up in base. Oh, the phone. Okay. Phoenix is hitting really poor accuracies. I mean, I don't know if it's because he's been spamming a bit or anything, but he's hitting 31 rail, 25 LG. No, I saw wins. Wasn't too high on the rail percentage either. Maybe it's just the way they play the map. We're going to get a pause. Right. I thought I'd do that just in case. Three, two, that was a, one. Fight. a somewhat reminiscent of a pre-abort game. And Phoenix is defending closely to Gerpa on his tail a bit, and Phoenix is running out of ammo. Oh, and that's at least gonna Gerpa's gonna pay a bit for picking up that yellow, but Phoenix is gonna be the one who's got it. But look at that, Vertex with the full red armor stack. Well, he's had the full red armor stack. And the plasma from Q50, he's gonna return it. Oh, that's come to nothing. And Demon now is to the house. He's hoping for more than that. Gerpa's gonna be the one to reap the benefits. And now he's gonna attack. He wishes he had a rocket though, I think. Wow, and the plasma da the damage there from uh, Maki was spectacular. Oh my god, and Demon's gonna Ready for this hit. red again. <laughs> nice, yeah. He's hitting 70% rail. I don't think he's had that many shots of it though. Yeah, probably not too many. Here we go, this could be a good attack. Needed to do more to wins there. And now Q50 needs to go down quickly. Demon's gonna do a lot of damage here. Oh my god, yeah, he brilliant. just rid of the defense. Oh, look at the spore on that. <laughs> yeah. Can you get the kill? That's unfortunate. I think Demon got the kill. No, no, win it. Here Gerpa. we go, Gerpa. Maki's straight on it again. I'm going to go off to Gerpa because he's made it to mid now. Maki went down. Gerpa's gone down. The flag has been returned to the Triple H. But not... Yeah, I know he's finally getting it as well. Demon's going back in. Plasma being a sort of weapon of choice at the moment. So, who, so who's your favourite plasma player now? Still Q50? Q50. <laughs> no one beats my Q50. Your Q50. <laughs> <laughs> Q50 though, he's hitting good with plasma accuracy, but his rail accuracy. I think since that C2 game where he was hitting practically 70%, he seems to have just gone downhill for that. Easy shots though, he's hitting C2. Yeah. When you're a defender, you got up that bounce pad, you're just aiming for the bounce pad shots. Mm. At the other end, so. This is true. But I mean, do you, do you want to call it now? 
Uh, the, the I think hot, hot, hot it's going with actually, funny yeah. enough. Uh, I yeah, but I, I wouldn't want to call either way, but I just think it's the momentum is slightly with them at the moment. We've now got this power up actually in Demon's hands. I think we're going to see overtime. 15 to 6 on the reds, by the way. Wow. You got a clean red there. And what's that? Is that, is that Lincoln, who's usually the one who's... You got more yellows too. Getting the red armor when he's playing? I, I don't I'm not really know. sure, I mean... Ha so, uh, Ha are especially focused on getting those reds, as I remember watching them. Yeah, m maybe Unknown kind Team of again. on doing the damage at red rather than picking it up. Maybe they don't care so much for, you know... Yeah, you there. can think that, but I mean, at the same time, they haven't done any damage every time I've seen Demon pick it up. Mm. Yeah, Demon has been one to get away with it. You need to do great. something with it though, really. And you got the frag on Q50 there, but he didn't really do anything to wins, which is the key. Yeah, he, it's, when he does that, it's really uh, Defense. It's a nice defensive play. He's hitting 56 to rail 45 LG. Pretty dizzy. As he's there hanging around this red, trying to get damage in. Just going to get rid of those LGs on the floor. Doesn't want to offer them to his opponents. Could cause a fuss in red. And he wants this next red. Maki should go down. Nice direct rockets, but Vertex is coming in now. And he's got a clean red. And uh, that Q50 there with the plasma. It's going to be a little bit of a jump up, I feel. And he's coming in for the close range rail shots. What the hell? The choice of weapons in Vertex are very strange. That seems to be working out okay for him. He's, he had timing there on uh, the yellow also. Phenomenal. It's quite a simple map though. Yeah, I mean, it's a very simple layout. Two yellows and a red. Anybody who's good at duels should be able to time all of them. Yeah. And you don't need to time your base one if you're attacking, so... Precisely. Here we go. Gerpa with this pickup steals away the yellow on top of that. Maki with the other flag pickup. This could be a big oh, moment. We can see a cap coming on here. But they've both got the flag. They oh, just see each other. Oh, there's a rail left. <laughs> this is wow. such a big moment. Out of the mid. I'm on Phoenix though. Oh my god, how did he survive that? He doesn't want to get spawned on. There's no oh, there's health bubble at all. Wins is Wins. In I don't think Wins knew he had the flag for a second there. I, I'm gonna I'm gonna hang around on Wins just for a second. He looks like there's maybe it's a little bit of pressure good. on him. Both the defenders now have the flags right, and both are looking relatively strong armor-wise. And you remember what happened the last time we were in a cross-cap situation? It was... Unknown. 11 minutes of it. Yeah, 11 minutes, and it was unknown to come out top. I don't know, let's just expect this cross-cap to take us through to overtime. Now, I would imagine a cross-cap situation... Cross-steel, I'm going to say. Which is the correct term. Excellent. <laughs> don't know where this cross-cap stuff came in. It's, it's not the way I used really to know angry. it. <laughs> Cro yeah, this cross steel situation maybe favours unknown. What do you think? I at the moment I would say it, it should favour unknown, but at the moment oh, Triple Wind's H gonna get caught out wow, yeah. so badly there. And that's that's his position was abysmal. I don't know why you'd stand down there. Hmm. Yellow wasn't up for a little while longer, and I was gonna say just fifties now happened. got it. Oh my god, Maki and Demon are uh, Vertex are attacking way better at the moment than Hazard uh, and. Uh, the other one. The other one, yeah. Q50, of course. <laughs> Q50 now with the flag grab, flag carry. I, I'd i say almost that Q50 is a safer bet with the flag because, I mean, we saw it there. He wasn't going to take the fight. Yeah. Well, Wins has got just it. Yeah, way. yeah he's giving it to Wins again. Makes sense to give it to your defender. Wins has got such solid aim, though. Yeah. He's probably the stronger player than out of the two, but... Yeah, I'd say so, but I'm, I'm going to watch Demon now, because he looks like he wants to do an attack. Yeah, yeah. and he's stuck. He doesn't has no intention of bringing it back for his... Uh, he needs to let it stack. He can't afford the flag carrier to get this, so... He needs it to count down a bit more first. This is, I, I don't know, I think this, this is possibly even fine Yeah, now. this is fine, yeah. Nice railroad, oh, this one. This could be the return on the cards here. Wins in a terrible position. He lands a good rocket. Oh, Demon's not hitting his rockets! And he doesn't have any LG ammo, no! Oh, Wind. God, Wind's... Wind's getting away with absolute murder there, I think. Demon was very unfortunate not to hit his shots. Or should I say Wind's was very fortunate that Demon didn't hit his shots? Yeah, I think it's more that, isn't it? 
I, it's hard to know exactly who did well there. In Obviously, the Winners did well, but you feel like Demon could have done a bit better. Yeah, for sure. A little bit let down, emotionally. <laughs> Fellow Frenchman, eh? <laughs> He's Belgian, I think. Like the, that's not even... Yeah! What? <laughs> who? Wins? I thought you were talking about Demon, sorry. Oh, right, yeah. So, yeah. Actually, that would have made more sense, wouldn't it? Yeah. Oh, well. <laughs> But wins are still kind of f fairly weak at the moment. But I really think, you know, Demon and such should really be thinking about the rail, because Demon was doing nicely with the railgun in offense. And, wow, Phoenix actually seeing his first bit of pressure in a little bit of time now. And, uh. Feels much more comfortable to him, though, so I think I was wrong about who offered the most threat. Yeah. Yeah, I think um, Hot Heart coordinate their attacks better together. And also wins yeah. positioning, really, when he's carrying the flag, I don't think is very good. Really? Well, it's the way it has, it quiet it has, before it, it has shown to be that. Oh, oh my god! Look at that. Oh, it's kind of Almost another one. He's looking to get the frag and the kill, whereas maybe he should be looking to avoid any kind of shots hitting him first. Yeah, well, that's kind of where I like Phoenix. Phoenix seems on this map, I think he feels he looks a bit more comfortable to me. And that's kind of why I said last week, you could just be really upset at what I said, but, you know, from, from what I've seen in the last six months, Phoenix really has been, you know, such a solid player here. And Demon, I think, is going to give it back to him. He doesn't have the drop power bind, though. Oh, but during that time, I think that the failure of having a drop power bind is giving Gerper a yellow. Phoenix is going to want to pick up this shot. Yeah, it won't matter too much. Yeah, he's, he's still got a strong enough uh, stack that doesn't matter too much. I, I really want to follow an attacker, but I, I don't want to be flicking around and then missing the action. Wind's taking up these lower positions. I just can't help but thinking it's well. a dangerous place to play, because you could just be dropped on any second mm. very quickly. When you're in the upper position, it's a lot harder for anybody to ambush you. Wind's moving out to midfield there. Oh, wow. He's low as well. You take a rail shot. That's it, though. Gotta be careful behind him. Mackie's there, he's got a landing of rocket, and then what? Vertex there. Gonna go down here, isn't he? Wind is so low. It's down, he's dead. health, he's dead. Can they get... What, what the hell? hell? What just happened? Almost. <laughs> there you go. Hot, hot, hot. hot. That, was a f that cap took 5 minutes and 50 seconds to do. So that's not too bad. But why wouldn't post it on the defect forums? It's just... I don't know. What, did you, what do you think about his positioning there? It just seemed a bit... I, I, I don't know. Wins looked like his priorities were just a little bit wrong. Defense. I, I I think from the evidence we've just seen here, to me, Phoenix really is maybe a better natural defender here. Or a natural cross steel thing. I don't know. I think Wins is very much a tdm -er. Yeah, do you think it's more in his blood than uh, CTF? Yeah, and I think when you're a TDM, -er, you sometimes look to get shots and get the kills rather than avoid the damage. Yeah. Especially when you're a player like Wins, who's just so dominant in TDM. It is like a different mindset that, that you go through. And it's kind of what I've seen. I don't know if Sparta's been playing much TDM at all, but he, he seems to have adopted that kind of mindset where he's not really willing to go defensive so much. And, and, Know, backing away. Really, they think they're challenging their manlyhood. <laughs> yeah, well, Spy was. It's always a, a CTF uh, in the past, actually, in Quake 3. Hmm. But he's also played a high level TDM. I think Spy is one of the best all rounders. I mean, he's obviously a very high level duel as well. Reached the Quake yeah, final, etc. So. so, probably the best all rounder. Really. I think, uh, Avec, I don't think it's bad. Avec's looking for a Sturmy. Is he good at CTF? Uh, Avec's good at TDM and Duel. CTF I haven't seen so much of him. Yeah. But then again, there's also Sturmy, and Sturmy used to play high level CTF. And TDM. And Duel, I can't, uh, criticize him. Yeah. Him. But then again, we don't see enough I don't think him. he's achieved as much in quite line in terms of Duel as Sparty, so... No, that's true. But when you see him play now, it's just crazy the things he's capable of doing. He still beats Avec in duels, and Avec still beats Sparty in duels, so... Yeah, but we are coming up to the last minute and a half, and we should really focus on what Unknown is able to do in these last... I have to say, months. it's looking unlikely. Yeah. I really don't think it's going to happen. 26 to 16 on red pickups, they're at one yellow ahead as well. 
Oh, yeah, first ah, hot, hot, hot. First X was stacked there, completely just ruined that attack that Unknown had prepared. Power up in 15 seconds, it's going to be the, potentially the last uh, power up of the map. Interesting, Gerpa is the one sitting in defense now. Oh, really? Yeah, wins, as you see, at midfield with his stack. I think Gerpa's going to He's going to get the power up. Okay, this is big, but he needs, to, he needs the teammates there. This oh, is going to be great rocket by Maki. Oh, then they're all in there. Yeah, they Every have to. And Demon steals away that 50 health level. Oh, that rocket. This could. Oh, and Vertex is there. Hazard still has an opportunity. He's got uh, a haste. Players are there. Mac is also got a touch though. This is uh, possibly more critical. Yeah, Hazard's get the base here though. Hazard's there though. He drops it off for wins. And look at that. Mac. He's got all three They're of his teammates there. To defend him. They're if he gets them. into his... Oh, look at this. Vertex. 150 armor. They don't need to do anything. They don't need to go into base. They don't need to do anything. They just need yeah, to just stay out of the way. At the they got weapons. Oh, he spots Bye, Hazard. Hazard. Yeah. <laughs> And he just runs away, you see there the way he, he, he sees him and then just moves backwards just to avoid, you know, direct conflict. He doesn't want to be in midst of the action, he knows what he's got to do. Just keep the flag away from him one more second and that is going to be the finals. Wins. This time it is going to be hot, hot, hot who takes it away from us. Why a rivalry between these two building up? Yeah, it definitely. But some really fantastic games, I mean, what is there to highlight of this cup? I'd say the... PP losing to uh, Can't Be Arsed, I think, was quite something uh, strange. Um, there was the... Previous map, this game, yeah. Q50 getting killed on the flag post to give um, them the map victory to Hot Hot Hot. That could have been key. I mean, that would have made it 2-2. Two, two. Yeah. It could have been done in two maps in favour of... Uh, unknown. Unknown, yeah, so... That, that was definitely something worth watching. It was um, around the sort of 16, 17 minute mark of uh, map 2 in the finals. So yeah, spider crossings. Definitely something uh, worth uh, watching again. I think I might actually watch it again at some point. Um, and once again, I'd like to say thanks very much to Solar Gaming League for uh, putting these tournaments on for us. Uh, Sorry, CSN. Huh? Yeah, but they're the ones paying money and stuff. CSN and... I meant the other... Yeah, shut up. <laughs> but yeah, thanks to CSA. Well, the thing about sponsors, let's be clear, right? Mm -hmm. Sponsors are getting their value. That's the whole point. Yeah, they put in money to advertise their product or whatever. Uh, they're putting in money to the tournament, mm. not to us. I know. Yeah, but they're still good, and uh, you know, if we want to see more uh, nice Quake tournaments, then I think we should uh, we should be happy to support them a little bit, just a, a teeny bit. Yeah, well, they've done a good job. This is true. Um, yeah, so, have you got your TDM? When's that starting? Yeah, TDM will be starting soon, I don't know, really. It depends when the games are going to be played. Mm. Um, let me just find out if I can, but I guess I'll be taking over the streaming. That's probably in an hour at least. I don't think there's any for a while, anyway. Yeah. Let me see. Oh, no, actually, it might be in 15 minutes. Fair enough. Soon. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I'll have to find out. And there will be some... Uh, tweets about it and some uh, IRC messages I believe and uh, li much later tonight around the sort of 1am mark I might decide to bring in some North American uh, dual action um, and okay there's a game now so I'm gonna are you gonna stream yep All right. I will be do you, do you in, in, in 15 minutes so I'm gonna go live on TV one straight away pretty much so as soon as you've gone down all right okay well the, um, then in that case shall we play another ad and then do you want to switch the stream over yeah exactly all right guys so I'm gonna say goodbye now uh, and I'll leave you with uh, Vor is gonna be with you yeah hopefully <laughs> <laughs> all right, awesome. so I'll see you guys in a bit and we'll switch them around now play ad 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 ad, ad. I played it. All right.